Hello, my name is Neil Deng. I live in Kakum Refugee Camp in Kenya. I'm original from South Sudan, but I've been living as a refugee in Kenya for the last 10 years. I was exposed to violence and armed conflict at a very young age, and my experience laid the foundation for the work I do today, having experienced first and our young people are often affected a lot by armed conflict and war, and how the very same young people can also play a key role in achieving long-lasting peace in a country affected by armed conflict and war. I firmly believe that young people like myself have the abilities, the capacities, the resilience and the courage to lead and drive real positive change in their communities. And I've been involved with Generation Unlimited in different capacities. Recently, I was involved as a global judge for Generation Unlimited Youth Challenge, helping select some of the best ideas. And one thing that has struck me the most is that sometimes the best ideas can come from the most neglected and marginalized communities. And I think that raised the alarm that everyone has a role to play toward achieving a more peaceful, secure and sustainable world. My work focuses a lot on helping young people in the camp be able to improve their life through quality education, mentorship and social entrepreneurship, and also do a lot of advocacy to help ensure that our voices are heard and are actually part of global conversation about issues that affect us. One thing I'm also very keen on is how young people from conflict-affected areas, like where I come from, can be seen as key actors, not just as victims, and actually given a prone seat in working toward achieving long-lasting peace in their countries. I'm super excited to see young people from all walks of life taking the lead in their communities, breaking barriers every single day, and disrupting system of powers. As young people, I believe that we cannot afford to stand on the sideline anymore, because if we fail to take action today, we will inherit all problems our world are facing, climate change, weak health system, and corrupt system. This is the right time to take the lead. Our time, our turn, our future.